Hello, guys. Uh, this is Harmy. Uh, you may know me as the creator of the Star Wars The Specialized Edition. Uh, if by some chance you don't know what that is, uh, even though you're watching this video, uh, you can see a sort of behind the scenes video in the description uh, below. It's a sort of work in progress, uh, but it should give you a good idea about uh, what the Despecialized Edition is. Uh, and today I'd like to uh, show, share with you uh, some cool stuff that I got for my uh, Star Wars collection, uh, which is behind me right here. Uh, it's a very sort of small collection, but I'm pretty proud of it. Uh, and I got some very cool items from uh, some of my friends in the last couple of weeks. Um, I met some I met some really cool people uh, through uh, working under the specialized editions, and uh, some of them sent me some stuff. So I'd like to uh, thank them via this uh, video here. Uh, so let's get right to it. Uh, so this is my Star Wars collection. Um, I have various releases of Star Wars on VHS, uh, mostly uh, Czech and other European releases. Uh, these here are the German 95 releases and the British widescreen 95 releases. Uh, then I have the 2000 releases that came, uh, with, came out with Episode 1, so they have uh, those covers that fit with Episode 1. Uh, Here's the Czech release, here's the British release, uh, and of course, uh, the two prequels that go with it. Uh, uh, oh, and uh, the third one. It, the, the prequels are sort of a parody anyway, so I, I figured it fits this way. <laughs> so, uh, But the uh, important thing I want to talk about is my uh, action figure collection, because uh, I, I got some cool action figures uh, from uh, one of my friends. Uh, his name is Troy Patterson. He's from Alabama. Uh, and I, uh, I was missing some figures from my collection. And uh, let me tell you a, a little story of uh, what's behind my Star Wars collecting. Uh, I actually, uh, as a kid... I always wished I could have those Star Wars figures, but they weren't they weren't really available here in the Czech Republic. So uh, when I got older, I sort of fulfilled my childhood dream and uh, started buying Star Wars action figures as they became available here. And when I visited Britain, uh, I bought some there. Um, and uh, my sort of goal was to collect uh, all the main characters uh, from all three original movies. Uh, so I, I have Darth Vader here, and um, I, I have a vintage Darth Vader. He's sort of there in the back because he's kind of damaged. Uh, but I, I got him really cheap uh, in like a secondhand shop. Uh, I've got Obi-Wan. Uh, this one I actually got from another one of my friends, uh, Anna Coley. Uh, so I'd like to thank her as well. Uh, she sent... Obi-Wan to me I, when I was missing Obi-Wan. Uh, I have uh, Leia, Han, and Luke. Uh, I have another Star Wars Han uh, because I, I bought this one uh, with the Stormtrooper armor, and I also had this one, so i sort of keeping him in the back here. <laughs> uh, of course, uh, R2-D2 and C-3PO uh, and some Rebel soldiers, uh, a rebel soldier and a rebel pilot. Uh, now, for Empire, uh, I have this awesome Darth Vader uh, in his uh, meditation chamber. Uh, a couple of stormtroopers here, uh, Captain Nita, you know, apology accepted, Captain Nita. <laughs> uh, this is... Uh, General Wright, no, Wright Ken is the, uh, okay, uh, I'm spacing out on the general's name, anyway. Uh, oh, General Veers, right, I just remembered. Um, 
course, Boba Fett uh, and Slave One. Uh, and one figure I was missing and uh, couldn't find anywhere in the Czech Republic uh, was Lando. So I've got uh, Empire Luke and uh, Han and Leia, uh, but I was missing Lando. Uh, so thanks to Troy, who uh, uh, whom I told uh, which figures I was missing, uh, and he he sent me all, got got them off of eBay and sent me all the uh, main characters that that I was still missing. So one of them was Lando. Uh, another one was the Emperor. So I finally got the villains from Jedi as well. Uh, and uh, the one I was missing the most, uh, Slave Leia. <laughs> so. So now I've got the main trio uh, for all three movies and uh, all the main bad guys and all this other stuff. Uh, here are the uh, DVDs. Uh, but as you can see, I took the inside inserts and used them as the front uh, front covers for the DVDs, so I think this this way they look much cooler than with the photoshopped uh, pictures that were originally on the front of those uh, DVDs. These are the 2004 DVDs. Uh, here we have the 2006 limited editions. Uh, of course, uh, the damnable Blu-ray release. Uh, and episode 7, 8, 9, uh, the Throne Trilogy. <laughs> Uh, so, once more, uh, thanks to uh, Anna for uh, Obi-Wan, and uh, thanks to Troy for Lando, the Emperor, and Golden Bikini Leia. Uh, thank you very much, guys. Okay, now to the next item. All right, this next item uh, I got from my friend Jim Kelly from Scotland, and it's pretty damn awesome. Uh, he got it at uh, some convention, and it's this, okay, I'm gonna try go somewhere where, where it will be less reflective. Um, it's a picture of Darth Vader and Boba Fett signed by both Jeremy Bullock and uh, David Prowse. So that's totally awesome. Uh, and it's got a certificate of authenticity, so it's definitely the real deal. Very cool. Thank you, Jim. Okay, now last but definitely not least, uh, my friend Ron from San Francisco sent me something so totally awesome that uh, it inspired me to make this video and I wanted to do like a proper unboxing here. So, get ready because this is gonna blow your socks off. Yeah, I want to be really careful here. I don't want to damage the goods. And I'm only using one hand, so it's kind of difficult. Um, so some of you know, some of you may know what the, this is. But for those who don't, Okay, look at this. Star Wars Trilogy, the Specialized Edition box set. Okay. So again, this is from a guy named Ron, and as you can see, this is a fantastic box set. Uh, I mean, if 
this box set was released officially, most Star Wars fans, including me, would probably pee in their pants a little. All right? So that's how awesome it is. It's got all three original movies in these uh, awesome uh, Criterion uh, Blu-ray boxes which, as you can see, don't have the thing on the top, so uh, the cover is bigger. And Of course, uh, the original poster art. Uh, here we have Return of the Jedi. Each one has a, pic has a couple of pictures on the back, showing off that this is the original unaltered version of the movie. There's also this cart in there. See, widescreen collector's edition, Star Wars trilogy, the despecialized edition. Freaking awesome. Look at that. Beautiful. There are also these two cards included. This is Ron. I'm going to cover his face in case he doesn't want to <laughs> in in case he doesn't want to be uh seen online. Um and this is me. So I've got my own Star Wars trading card. <laughs> I'm just I'm just in awe. Uh, it's it's so awesome. This this whole set is brilliant. Okay, so let's open the boxes. There's art on the inside as well. Totally awesome. Look at that. And there are some other goodies in here. Check this out. Reproductions of the original lobby cards. Okay. So let's have a look at these. You can't probably see it in the video, but these are very high quality prints as well. And they're on thick cards paper. Beautiful, just beautiful. Okay, there's also some awesome art on the inside. Uh, oh yeah, in, in case you were wondering, the discs are not included because uh, uh, because I I already uh, have discs that I can put in there, and uh, I will, however, print uh, runs. Of designs on them to put them in this box set. Uh, here are some more goodies in here. Uh, Star Wars posters. Also beautiful inside art. Okay, let's look at those. I don't want to damage the envelope. at that. God, this is awesome. Really, really, really awesome. Like I said, like, this could be the official release, and I would be totally happy with it. More than happy. I mean, you saw I uh, collect uh, the original box sets. 
here. Uh, but this this is going to be the crown jewel of that collection. Okay, let me put this all back together and uh, show you where uh, it will be in my collection. All right, so here it is. So once again, I'd like to thank Anna, Troy, Jim, and Ron for adding all this awesome stuff to my Star Wars collection. <laughs>